Hey guys, I just wanted to show you around Windows Vista business. Um, I got this about two months ago, and at first I had problems with it. It crashed on me, but that was my own fault. So I got that worked with. So uh, I just want to show you around it. Um, you got you see the uh, new start menu and the taskbar um, I like it's much improved um, I'm using a Vista basic theme because I um, don't want to eat away my memory like that um, I'm going to show you the control panel they redid it uh, I have it set classic view because I so used to it uh, here's the home when it loads up um, you'll see that it's much different there's different um, things you can do uh, let's go to I'll do Okay, I'll show you um, security. Um, I'll go uh, open up, uh, check the security status. I wanted to show you that um, they've added or integrated Windows Defender into this. So, um, you know. You'll, you won't have to download a spyware program, although I would, but I haven't yet. Um, but it's nice that Microsoft decided to do that. Um, let's check out some other differences. You, they give you Windows Calendar, and Media Player is different. Open that up. It might take a while because I'm using screen capture, so bear with me, please. Okay, you'll see that it's much different. They've integrated a search in here as they have in the taskbar. So I'll, I'll show you an example. Let's say I wanted to, uh, it, it runs kind of like. Uh, the run option in the uh, older versions of Windows. So um, let's say I wanted to open up the registry editor. I'd put reg edit or edit and then you, as you can see it brings it up with uh, no searching of you. Um, I want to show you something. Um, when you open up a program with this little security icon, I just now noticed. I noticed this like a few um, ma or a month or so after I got this. I'm like, how do I know if it's gonna do that? Well, it has this little icon right here, and that means you will have to be have uh you have to give permission to open it i don't want to open this right now so i'm just going to click cancel uh it brings it into like a a black or gray screen in the background so you, it's supposed to prevent malware from even getting on your computer uh let's see what else i want to show you the new games They've added a lot, which I was kind of thankful for because XP really didn't have that much. They had horrible games. And now they, they added Mahjong Titan and others. I'll post video uh, you can, uh, business um, how to get games. But as you can see there's quite a lot of games they added chess titans and you know uh 
little kid games in this Purple Pal as like a match game or an address up game. And you might notice that it all programs it goes inside to uh, where your other programs or your uh, quick start programs are which is very nice because I was um, if your computer is kind of slow which I've used slow computer it'll uh, bring up a box and as you, you probably know that goes out the hair and it's kind of annoying but you can't just have to deal with it. Um, let's see. Uh, Windows Mail. That's new. It's supposed to replace uh, Office. Or not Office, but uh, Express. I really hated that program. It was horrible. And uh, let's see. I'm trying to think. We've integrated this into here. This new stuff, recent. I don't think XP had it, but I don't know. Um, computer. Um, they've added. Uh, I guess they didn't add, but they have new icons now. Um, I'll probably post a video later that shows how to do the recovery environment. So in case your computer crashes, you have the repair option, so you don't have to take out the disk. Unfortunately, I did download, and it doesn't have a disk. So I had to reinstall XP when it crashed and install this again. So that's about it with Windows Vista. Uh, overall, I like it, but if you have an older machine with less processor speed I would not recommend it because it's it's even kind of laggy on this computer and I'll show you system properties yeah as you can see um, it's loading up I have a it's a pretty good system I like it, it ran XP pretty good but I only have a rating of 2.6 and I'll show you what that means um, 5 or you want to get around 5 because that means you really have a good experience but look at my primary hard disk it's probably the highest on my thing um, my gaming graph is really logging me down and so is my RAM um, but other than that, it's pretty good, and it's, I guess it's more secure because of the uh, user account control, but uh, you can disable that if you don't like it. So uh, overall, I'd say it's a pretty good product by Microsoft. Um, so that's, there you have it. Thank you.